up you guys? Back again. Uh, today, another session with Cooking with Remy. And uh, today we're going to do things a little differently. Today is... I figured we'll cook up with vinegar today. As we do. So, what I'm going to do today is cook with some vinegar. The same type of egg. Except a little different. It's like a little bit different from what we all are normally used to. So open up these blinds. We're gonna get cooking. Anywho, um as you guys can see, what I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna add a little bit of vinegar and oil to the pan from my special bottle. Um, basically you want to add a small amount. I've never done this, so I don't know what this is going to taste like truly. It smells very authentic. But hey, we're going to give it a shot. We switched that around. It may look bubbly, but that's okay. I mean, this is going into my mouth, not yours. What we're going to do is we're going to add a piece of ham to the middle of the pan, in the middle of the pot. This one's kind of jagged and I did wash my hands. So anyone's like, oh, you didn't wash his hands. Uh, shut up. I did. I washed them. You did. So that's first. It's in the middle, like I said. Don't mind my cat, she's talking. This is generally when my cat plays. I don't know why she does, she plays, but. Um, part two, I'm gonna scooch up over here. Um, what's that camera angle? Basically, we're going to do the eggs on top of that. And this is, I told you guys in the last cooking video, um, basically what it is, that's, um, this is maybe a little different, the taste and consistency, but, I mean, we'll see. This is with oil, I normally don't use oil, and I normally don't use that much of stuff when I'm eating stuff. So like I said, this is for my palate, and my palate alone. Anyway, it's clean. Uh, we're going to, like I said, chop it up again. Like, blot it out. Blot it. And that part is done, for the most part. Um, second part going to cut, we're going to cut some onions and tomatoes. Now, you've seen me cut before, you know how I cut. I'm not going to use that much because I don't need, I don't need that much onions on mine. But, like I said, you over here again. <coughs> Excuse me. Like I said, um, we're not going to use that much. And basically, this is a different type of recipe. This is for taste, clearly. I don't know how strong the vinegar will be. We're going to give it a shot, though. We're going to try this. And I'm feeling brave today. I filmed literally uh, some cool stuff. If you watched the video before this one, filmed lots of cool stuff. So please watch that at some point. Me going to an art museum here in Jacksonville. I filmed a 
The St. John's Bible. It's a very huge book in Mayo Clinic. That's in my last video. And also, too, you can catch my other um, videos I did. A one called Star Ender. It's like a feature film. A small short film. Musical film, actually. You can watch that on my channel as well. Very good, interesting film that I did. Um, pretty much what I'm doing now, I'll bring you guys over here, is I am mincing up the um, stuff here I cooked. So, that's getting minced up. And pretty much the same concept of what I'm doing now is adding this stuff to it. I mean, my Sazon, as y'all remember. The Sazon I added. And also, too, I know I've been saying this over and over again, but tomorrow is the day for the unboxing video. And, you know, we're going all out tomorrow when we film that. So, please, 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 please be aware of that film going, the YouTube video going up. Um, like I said, check it out. Rate it later, if you'd like. I'm going to move you guys back just a smidge. So you guys can actually see the... Now, this is with oil and vinegar. Tomatoes and the ham. So, this is a little bit more, a little bit different from what I've been making. Of course, it wouldn't be complete without a little oregano. In the middle of it. And that's basically it. Now, this dish, I don't know how this dish will taste. I really don't know how it's going to be. It might be bad. It might be good. It might be totally crap. But, that is the process. The second process for making that uh, come pass, come true. Um, another tip is this was handmade. That, uh, that, well, that oil and vinegar, I hand made that together. Um, basically that's the basic principle. The taste, I will probably taste similar or taste stronger. Who knows what the taste will be like. But, I do know the taste will be a little bit different from what I've been making. Um, we'll see. But anywho, this will, I'm going to do a part two testing to taste it. I mean, you know from here, you've seen the other video, I will flip this. Pretty much that is about it for this part. Um, like I said, this is with vinegar and oil. I do not know how this will turn out. I really don't, you guys. But I mean, it seems like it's cooking pretty good. Let's hope it tastes as good as I, uh, is it, I said it is. I mean, you can smell it. It smells pretty decent. I'm not going to lie. It smells pretty, pretty damn decent. That's the ham that's bubbling up. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, not much to say, really. Um... Also, too, I want to give a shout out to Kingdom Hearts and Disney for uh, just a shout out to them. Good memories with them. This time we're going to get a special black plate to try this one because this is a little bit more advanced, I feel. And look at that. I mean, it's bubbled up. But, I mean, that's how it's supposed to be. Just wish I had some cheese with it. Look at that. You, you guys see that? Yeah, this is pretty much 
finished in its infancy. Ooh, that smells good. Never cook with vinegar. I've never cooked with vinegar, you all. I can never flip it perfect on camera, but I don't care. Um, everyone I'm not filming, <laughs> it turns out perfect. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, you guys. But anywho, um, you see this. Um, what I was going to say. Basically, y'all are seeing it as it unfolds. Y'all seeing this. Let's give it a shot. That is the finished product. Do not mind my kitty. She's very talkative today. I don't know what it is. Sometimes she does that. You heard her in the background. But yeah, that is my plate. Now, we're going to try this. Hopefully, it's not bad. Cooking with vinegar, we'll see. Now, we're going to give this a little taste. It's different. Can't taste the vinegar. Definitely can't. But, it's good. It's very good. Um... Vegetably, I taste the spices in there that I put in there. No, no vinegar. I don't taste the vinegar at all. But anywho, thank you guys for watching Cooking with Remy. That was part two. That was a little bit more extravagant for you guys. So thank you guys for watching. Hit like and subscribe. Tomorrow, like I said, will be the unboxing. <laughs> I said it about bajillion times. I'm excited. I'm raring to go. Tomorrow, you guys. It's tomorrow. It's uh, literally upon us. So thank you guys for watching. Hit like and subscribe. Try this recipe. Try the other one. If not, don't try it at all. But just know you saw it here on Cooking with Remy. Peace.